You too. Hello, Mr. Cash 22 here. Listen, like, comment, subscribe down below. Let's get this party started. As the title say, this is about Comp TIA Network Plus. Um, this is the 007, Mr. James Bond edition. Unfortunately, uh, Mr. Mike Meyer, the incredible author of this textbook right here, will not be releasing 008 until February 11th, 2022. So check that on my link down below in the description. But anywho, regardless, um, if you're gonna take this 007 um, edition of the Network Plus or the newest one, 008, um, you can still be successful using this older material, in my personal opinion. Um, there's so many people that have passed the 007 because there are other study uh, materials that you can use from Udemy and we'll touch more on that later on today within this video. Um, but anywho, if you watch my A plus video, you can, you can see and you can tell that um, I also did kind of have the same structure of textbook as well from this author and I personally thought he did a phenomenal job so really shout out to Mr. Myers you did a fantastic job but as you know me personally I do like being very mobile very versatile uh, so I can't really carry this textbook with me at the gym while I'm running on the treadmill or something. But um, I stuck with the original uh, exam cramp. I loved it, found that incredible as well. Like I said, it's mobile. You can use your phone right here, um, bring it anywhere you wanna go. And I thought that was incredible. And like I said, we'll touch more on that. Um, one tip, I guess three tips that I'll give in order for you to be successful in order to obtain the certificate. Um, is basically making sure that you go online into the CompTIA website and looking at the objective, the objectives, excuse me. Uh, take note of that, please, please, I'm begging you. And then also, uh, if you want my personal opinion, uh, for number two, it's being very consistent. And uh, number three, also making sure that the questions that you do, you know, try to answer within these like study courses and classes that you take and these materials that you use, make sure that you're not trying to memorize just the answer, but understanding how they got the answer. Um, I'm not gonna lie, A plus um, with the material compared to Network Plus was a lot less. Network Plus is, it's a lot. I'm not gonna lie, it, it's, it's exhausting. So um, make sure you have time um, throughout the week, the day, just to like decompose and just try to understand the material because it's, it is stressful. And like I said, we'll switch, I'm on my camera right now, so we'll switch over to the laptop and kind of take a look at some of the objectives that CompTIA is kind of asking for. But for right now, um, one other, uh, I guess advice that I like to, slash tip, slash comment that I like to put out there is, um, yeah, make sure that uh, you study really hard for this. This is not a walk in a park. I'm not going to sit here and lie. It's uh, something, especially if you're not a network guy or uh, gal or come from a network background, if you kind of get what I'm saying. Because um, me personally, I, I did not. I'm, you know, I do cryptography engineer. So, like, uh, that's, this is not me. But, um, it's, it's doable, and that's what I want you to know, you know, and don't give up, no matter how many times you fail this um, certificate, I mean, excuse me, trying to, to fail this exam trying to get this certificate, don't give up, okay? Uh, keep going, uh, try to study, um, you know, and find new materials that you can work with, and then on top of that, uh, find, find a study partner, and I, I'm a very strong advocate in joining Discord, and Reddit as well, and we'll talk more on that as well. So let's switch over to the laptop. You know, I'm here chit chatting, and I'm gonna show you some tricks and tips that I use in order for me to become successful in obtaining my network plus. All right, fans, let's get to it. Uh, so I kind of already have some tabs open, so we can just jump straight uh, to this. Uh, so as you can see, we got the Cisco Packet Tracer. Like I said, I got a plethora of tools and websites, and you know, people that I use and. Cisco was my favorite. Um, just to give you a heads up, it's free to download. So like I said, just go to Google, uh, Bing, and all you have to do, I said Bing. <laughs> Man, it does Bing still six Microsoft Edge. Um, type in Cisco Packet Tracer um, on your browser. That's all you have to really do. And then uh, click on the Cisco, you know, the Netacad right here, website. And then as soon as you click on that, um, all you have to do is just go on the course and then the Cisco Packet Tracer, okay? So course right here, and then Packet Tracer. Then you'll scroll down, and then you'll see you get two prompts, whether it's the two hours, you know, introduction getting started, or the 10 hours. Mind you, you don't have to watch 
um, the tutorial with you know or do the prompt for 10 hours or two hours um, all you have to necessarily do is just create an account um, obviously so click on either or log in follow the prompt get your uh, email ready up and going go on your email you know make sure your accounts legit I mean excuse me your emails legit so approve that and then um, ask, answer any of the questionnaires that's being asked okay so then after that once you get that all situated you should get something prompt like this mind you you won't get what you see on the screen right now that's because I'm currently taking CCN uh, NA3 right now uh, at a technical college because I'm actually trying to obtain my CCNA um, certificate and it's the security as well so um, obviously you won't see this but then in regards to that once you get this type of prompt whatever prompts up on your screen all you have to do is go to resource and then download packet tracer so then when you click on download packet tracer just scroll down and then whatever I guess OS that you're running um, usually just shoot for the 64 bits okay that's exactly what I did and then once that happens it shouldn't take too long obviously make sure you have enough room in your you know your laptop PC enough memory obviously uh, you should get something that prompts like this uh, Cisco packet tracer and mind you when you click it the first time there'll be like a log like there'll be a, another smaller prompt that uh, will prompt up all you have to do is make sure you type in your username that you created and your password otherwise it keeps like kicking you out it's super annoying super weird I, I don't understand um, but just keep that in the back of your mind and then um, once you get in like I said if you watch those introduction tutorial videos you know the 10 hour the two hours you can just you can just go at it you know you can start building your PCs you know which is awesome you got your you know you got your routers right, right here you can even switch over to your switches I love it here's your connection and while you're studying you'll know about like the copper straight through the crossovers you know the fibers oh you'll, you'll love it so download Cisco packet tracer and like I said I would definitely go more in debt with this but it's more for the PBQs and um, with CCNA I feel like this is something that like that's a must that you should definitely know how to run you know run this thing but with um, network plus it's kind of just good just kind of get a feel of it honestly especially if you're trying to take that path into doing the CCNA all right so now that we got that situated on to the next this is another tab that I'll use right now I'll put an asterisk on this this obviously didn't necessarily help me but just for those who are kind of wondering the difference this is mind you from the uh, TIA.org website just the difference between the two exams as you guys can see you guys can compare and contrast the two um, also there's there's really not a whole lot of different in my opinion um, but the thing is you know every what three years if I'm not mistaken you know it's out with the old and with the new basically so um, so depending on which version you're going to do, whether it's the 007 or 008, the advice that I'm giving you, it, um, it should help you with either or. All right. So next, here it is. It's exactly what I was talking about. Mind, mind you, I'll drop all the links um, down below in the description. Here's the comp, uh, TIA Network Plus uh, objective. This will be your number one best friend. I promise you. This, this basically gives you the blueprint of what you're going to basically expect when you take your um, your exam okay uh, so you know you have a maximum of 90 question multiple choice performance space um, obviously um, you have to have a passing score of 720 and then look at the percent of the object of the objective you know on the exams you know and it tells you right there and that's that's why I love this and it breaks it down from the section like this is what you guys need to know the OSI model you know physical yeah trust me you you gotta know that any anything on here I'm not gonna sit here and like sugarcoat it it's a must like you must know you know the the acronyms the abbreviations you know the difference between a uh, star mesh bus ring hybrid the, the, all this this is important I promise you so this will be your best friend um, I cannot stress this enough um, but like I said I'll drop the link down below and like like I said comparing this to a plus this is a lot more this is no joke this is not something to take lightly okay it's crazy I'm getting like PTSD flashes from this because <laughs> yeah it's, it was not easy it was a lot um, but you'll do well don't even stress it so um, yeah, and I love this too because if you scroll down, you can also see 
um, the acronym list as well. All, you know, basically um, everything spelled out and every definition. So, yep, look into that. All right, so next, uh, not to waste too much time, uh, Reddit. Uh, in addition, just type in CompTIA and join this group. If you don't have Reddit and um, you're not a fan of it or you don't know what that is, just go on your, whether it's your app store or Google store and or even on your PC laptop and download this or even on your browser as well on your phone Um, because this community is phenomenal Um, you can you know if you don't know where to start or you don't know you know how to get your foot in the door into cybersecurity IT man this community is the best Uh, trust me as you can see there's uh, 124k members that's that's bonkers that man I think when I joined um, like last year there was only like 60 this this man this like double it's ridiculous and i'm grateful i love that you know technology is you know it's just only advancing um all right so next so join this group like i said uh check the link down below in the description next discord um alpha grad i will drop this link down below in the description there's about what a thousand 1.4k members in this group and like i said you'll love this group uh this is where i met one of my closest friends um, I, for, for my study partner, you know, when it come when it came time for CompTIA to study for these certs, um, and I met her through this group, and she lives all the way out in Georgia, you know. So I'm I'm telling you, this group will change your life because you'll meet amazing people, and you'll find people that will actually work on your schedule. Uh, I guess the time that you know needs to work best with you. But anywho, in regards to that, also I also like to throw out, uh, you know, follow me too, Simba King. You know, yep, yep, yep. That's that's me right here, Simba King. All right, so I'll drop that link down below in the description. Moving on to the next one, Udemy. Yes, Udemy. Network plus 008, okay? Look at this, my man, Jason Dion. This is the man, the myth, the legend, the truth. Um, He is the best. I cannot stress this enough. I would, oh, one, one rule of advice that I always like to stress out is never try, like I said, I mean, I feel bad for saying this, but I'm looking out for you guys, you know, and anyone that's watching, you know, guys, girls, they, them, you know, whatever. Listen, I'm telling you, this will um, change your life. Try buying this, these courses when they're on sales. Yes, buying it on full price. If you can afford it, go for it by all means. But man, if you're, if you're struggling, just, just wait till it goes on sales and they do like weekly sales. Oops. I didn't mean to click that. My apologies. They do weekly sales like crazy. Okay. So uh, keep your eyes out on that as well. Okay. Um, network plus, I don't know why I did that. That was my apology and I can't even go back, but anywho, uh, so the ones that I'll definitely recommend is one right here. Yes. Number two right here. I'll definitely recommend uh, this individual got good reviews. I have no clue. This is my first time seeing this guy. So I couldn't tell you. I'm being biased right now. So I couldn't tell you anything about him. But he looks like he knows what he's doing. So um, if anyone can leave a comment down below letting me know about uh, this individual, uh, please let me know. But anywho, um, I keep scrolling down. Uh, Mr. Mister Mike Meyer is something that I'll buy as well. And looks like, oh, but it looks like he has the 007. Um, so I should probably not go that far. So my apologies. I guess once Mike Meyer has a double and eight, that's something that you should look into. But I would probably, yeah, give this guy a shot. Um, like I said, his reviews looks nice. I have no clue who this individual is. Um, but like I said, leave a comment down below if you do know. All right, so on to the next one. Um, obviously, depending on the month that you're watching, um, this is another good tool to use. This is going to be on Amazon. Like I said, this is going to come out in February. It's not out right now. Obviously, it's January 19th, 2022. And, but this one's coming out uh, February the 11th, if I'm not mistaken. So keep your eye on it for this textbook as well. Um, so like I said, this is a phenomenal book, something to look into, and you shall be successful. I promise you. All right. And um, last but not least, I should also include that because like I said, this helped me a lot, but I don't think I have the double eight version. Um, I think I only have the double oh seven. Um, darn, I'm actually frustrated because I, th- I thought I had it saved on my desktop. Anywho, let me actually... Um, uh, see if I can just type it on Google for you guys. Sand cram. What's the number? What's the 
Yes. Okay. So, um, for some reason, I thought I had it on my desktop, but uh, this right here, exam cram, um, this this was phenomenal. Like I said, you can tra have this on your phone, uh, PDF version. Obviously, uh, you can get the the textbook uh, via Amazon online. But this this man, this helped me so much. Um, I cannot stress this enough. This was definitely my top favorite as well. Um, like I said, this is the 008 edition. You can also do the 007 edition, but this is a phenomenal book. Um, it's, it will help you a lot. Like I said, if you're very mobile and you can't carry a heavy textbook. And as and honestly, last but not least, oh, but also just to kind of throw that out there as well. Um, once you download this PDF file, you can use it like literally anywhere, like on your laptop, on your phone, like on your like, you know, on your second phone, on your cheating phone, like, bro, like, yeah, once you get this downloaded, you're set. And last but not least, um, I wish I would have brought him up as well. Uh, but so like I said, I love Jason Dion, Mike Myers, Professor Messer. Oh my gosh. Professor Messer Network Plus. This guy is the myth, the legend, okay? Looks like he has 007. Ah, here we go. He has 008 as well. Okay, perfect. Um, this guy, phenomenal. Ah, oh, man, I hate when that crap happens. It's weird that his website has ads that prompts up like that. This guy is phenomenal. Cannot stress this enough. Professor Messer, check him out on YouTube. Much love. Big shout out to him. You guys will thank me. Uh, phenomenal, phenomenal individual. But yes, I swear, I think I dropped like 10 things that should make you become successful. Um, but like I said, study hard, work hard, and be consistent. Uh, try to get a study buddy. And uh, feel free to leave a comment or ask questions. I'll probably drop my emails down, my email, excuse me, down below in the description as well if you have any questions. Good luck. Um, keep your head up. And like I said, our goal and everyone who's watching, I want you guys to all succeed and get to the top. Um, break, you know, break that, break into the field of cybersecurity or IT and, you know, create generational wealth. You know, wish you guys well, good health and prosperity. Like I said, feel free to reach out if you have any questions. Good luck and take care, y'all. Peace.